had a funding gap and uh, we have now appreciated the importance of sports, both in nurturing talent and also promoting Uganda as a country. So it is something that uh, as a government, they have taken it up in the right direction and uh, we are going to see more and more increased funding in the sports sector in the Ministry of Education. So, according to how we have been prepared as Uganda as a country, I want to, to thank the government of Uganda for supporting this sports up to this level. Uh, we have identified good talent and uh, the children are competing favorably in the whatever fields we have uh, we have uh, fielded them. So the, 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 the talent is there, the, 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 the will is there and uh, the, 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 the athletes themselves have the what it takes to compete. We just need to do much more to do domestic and local training. Uh, coupled with the international exposure. That's the only thing that is a bit lacking for our children and uh, the athletes that we have brought on board. But uh, in preparations, we are ready and uh, we are participating so well. Uh, what I have also observed is the, the food that the athletes are eating. We have, I have interfaced with them. They have been complaining about certain foods. They are not eating so well. They have been exposed to completely different diet they are in here and this has somehow reduced even the way they have been training. Uh, we are a bit worried that uh, some of them may not perform to the expectations, basically because of the food issues, but the team has taken it up and uh, uh, efforts have been made to supplement what is being uh, supplied here, plus uh, taking into account the, what the, the, the children want to feed on such that uh, we leave nothing to chance. Mm. Thank the National Council of Sports for this uh, far they have come. And we want to appreciate the government of Uganda. The Ministry of Education is really working so tirelessly. The Parliament of Uganda through appropriation of the budget. Of course, uh, it being the highest number so far, it, is, it calls for little celebration because uh, we have seen countries here building as many as 500 participants, uh, 600 participants, 300 countries are here with over 200 participants and they are fielded in almost all, all categories of competition. So we still have a long way to go and I uh, want to appeal to the government of Uganda, the means of education, to increase this, the, 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 the budget for the sports. You know, the, the, the local competition, the school games must be supported such that by the time we reach such a level, we have a number of people who are qualifying to participate and also be supported through adequate budget such that we are able to take almost even 200 people. That's when we shall have reached there. But uh, it is uh, a, a good step in the right direction so far.